Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, Hollywood Chono here about to bring you another episode of The Simpsons Tapped Out. Now, I just want to show everybody the awesomeness of the wishing well as it is about to be unleashed on us for 150 donuts for anybody that's curious on it. Yeah, and with that, later. you also get the leprechaun, a toy, toy, ta toy, toy, translation, burn things, kids. That is fucking cool because burning things is awesome. So now with the set complete, you get the standard bonus of $500 and 10 XP, which is no big deal. But with that, you get an Irish hand. It looks like oh. he runs really, really fast. Mm -hmm. Does he have any quests? No, but it looks like when you tap him, he runs really quickly. And he's been dropping $6 for me, so I don't know if he constantly does it. I don't even know where the little bastard went. There he is. So uh, you tap him, you get $6. He runs off to another location, and then he'll slow down. What the? So then when you keep tapping him, he will continue to drop stuff. Like that time, he just dropped 2 XP. And once you tap him, you can't tap him again for a few seconds. But you either get $6 or 2 XP, which is rounded up from $5 and 1 XP, and it's basically random. And the well, so far as a novelty item, no report on if it gives you money or not. Well, Flanagan's Pub will give you $90 and 10 XP every four hours. So you're talking between $95 to $100 and 10 to 12 XP, depending on your conformometer as well as any personal bonuses you have. But the Wishing Well does give you 4.5% more money and XP, which is always a good thing. Now we are going to find Tom of Flan again, and we're going to speed up the cleaning beer mugs because I have a few donuts left over, I'm and I'm I want to see what else you get with St. Patty's Day Part 2. So St. Patty's Day Part 2 is completed, and Tom of Flan again does not appear to have a quest, so I wonder if it's related to any of these other side quests. It doesn't appear to be, but as of right now, I only see two St. Patty's Day quests, and Tom O'Flanagan, because it's a normal character, has the standard thing for jobs, no 150% bonus, but basically the Leprechaun gives you something extra to do because you get a little bit of gold, a little bit of XP. This is great for people that like to frequent the 45 second jobs, as well as anybody that does you know, multiple things around their Springfield. It's basically just an idea to get a few dollars, but it looks like Homer does have a new quest from doing this. A Flanagan's Pub is open for business. Hold on, laddie. Running a pub is no picnic. It's hard work. Work that takes arbitrary lengths of time to complete. I'm a guy who needs six hours to lounge at a pool, but only six seconds to clean up nuclear waste. I know arbitrary, okay? And there's other tasks that might seem, well, a wee bit pointless. Like they don't necessarily aid in running a business. So... Make Tom O'Flanagan do an Irish jig, which I said would do something else like an idiot. And make Homer promote his What's bar, that? which is 12 hours. Mm, so my that is at 2.30 in the morning. I don't see myself staying awake for that one. So our next St. Patty's Day update will be tomorrow. So I kind of sped this one up a little bit by using donuts to... Uh, speed up the St. Patty's Day job, but if you like this video, please give a like rating, a comment, subscribe to my videos because there will be plenty more videos to come. And have a wonderful.